सो फाइनली रीच द कुल्ला टारो फेस्टिवल फॉर 2024 तो आज का दिन थोड़ा सा हेक्टिक रहा है तो अभी हम लोग हेड आउट करने वाले जजिंग के लिए सो हील टैटूज का जो कैटेगरी रहता है ना अभी उसके लिए जा रहा हूँ एज यू कैन सी दर इज अ लॉर्ड ऑफ स्टूडियोज हो गई बहुत अलग अलग स्टाइल की चीज़ें है इधर This one is number two. So I'm the elephant here, and this is an interesting concept. Which so a lot of people don't use this kind of style anymore. It's like a travel style, right? When you have a traditional wrap. There's very few. Maybe in Thailand, 30% of tattoo artists do it. Out of Thailand, very hard to find. Right, so very few people actually know about this as well. That's the uh, which style was it again? Uh, which style was it again? Bamboo. Bamboo. Or from Sakya. Sakya. So, what would you personally like as opposed to the tattoo on yourself? Like me? Yeah. Uh, I have color for me. I like black and gray. I like large, not too detailed. I think when you try to make too much detail. This is the first one though. Yeah, that's that's a good one. So which one is your first tattoo? This I line. The I line. And then still been by different artists. And I, when I was 18 or 12 years. Okay. Well, still by an apprentice. It's not very good. So this was apprentice work. Because I showed you in my life, that was an apprentice's work. That was his I think second or first tattoo of his career. Wow. Man. That's wow. the that's the beautiful alien. So how do you feel coming all from? Uh, you come from United States, Minnesota, or Minnesota. So how does it feel in India? I haven't lived in U.S. in ten years. Where I live it? in Thailand. Where is it? And so uh, coming from Thailand, this is my second time in India. It's different. Thailand people are very shy. In India people love to talk, and it's funny. It's fun. It's fun. Uh, Where are you from exactly? I'm from uh, Russia, but I'm based in Bali. I live there for. Yeah, and uh, what kind of machine do you use exactly? Is it uh, what kind of style do you use? I use just needle. Uh, so I do hand pop. I do hand pop with needle with painting. 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 And what kind of style do you use? Is it like basic uh, traditional style or something which uh, with uh, much more simplistic? Uh, I'm obsessed with uh, ornamental style. Chicago, you know, like he, he grew up over in America, Latin America, or whatever. 
And what would be a thing about machines, right? So there's coin machines, there's rugby machines. How do you think that game is evolving so far? Well, I mean, we're, I think we're pretty much at like 95% of rugby machines nowadays, which is, which is pretty amazing because when I, when I started getting into fantasy, it was only car machines or prison machines that were like made from a tape recorder or motor or so. And our rugby machines have come back and they can put them on my team. Right. So one of my dream would be like getting an old school prison tattoo across my chest or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A single needle uh, tattoo that has a different vibe altogether. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. I have a few friends who, who do this. You know, yeah, this is so new. Oh, I, I, that, that, it looks like you've used different needles altogether. Yeah. I don't believe there is just one needle. Actually, this is so they're just kind of awkward and single needles. Only two masters can do that. But, uh, this is insane. Yeah, yeah. But they, t- they take time and dedication to. Right, to and as well as uh, the ink that you, they used to make in the past, it was developed by the artist itself. So they used to make it themselves. Yeah, right. everybody had their own little secrets about that. Right. <laughs> so as of now, you're just getting everything mainline, like on a front, front of a store or something. But previously, people used to just make it in their basement or somewhere. Or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm glad this, we don't really do this anymore. You know? right. Because now the health regulations, uh, they are very important and they're very strict and it's a good thing. थोड़ा बहुत सिमिलर लाइन है हमारा मेरे बैंकिंग देखो बेसिक क्या है की आपको बेसिक को एडवांस
first day for this kulla festival i rushed back home which is almost around 2 hours away from the venue site uh, because hum log ka kuch planning tha jo didn't go accordingly and over the top i just went through some of the interviews all together for today's videos to mere end se kuch technical error hai i messed up the mic settings where uh, there was an echo between the mics so I just needed one mic and I just messed up the whole thing. So yes, audio will not be that clear for this vlog, but uh, the majority of the videos I'll try to scrub it off in the editing and fix it off for you guys. So आपको थोड़ा सा sense बनेगा मतलब if you go ahead and look into the videos तो थोड़ा sense बनेगा. It'll be a little bit sensible for you. I'll try to make sure I make an adjustment from my end for the uh, volume and so on. and today's festival first time for tattoo festival uh, i must say agar aapko koi bhi tattoo festival mein jana hai if you want to go to any kind of tattoo festival please go ahead and do so it's a wonderful experience all together uh, from meeting new kinds of tattoo the most interesting part of the whole festival ah, damn it was uh, the stickers so each art artist if they are international or not बिकॉज बहुत इंडियन आर्टिस्ट भी थे उधर इट्स नॉट ओनली दैट आउट ऑफ इंडिया के लोग इधर बैठ कर आए हैं या सो अलॉट ऑफ आर्टिस्ट हैड दे स्टिकर्स तो बहुत यूनिक कॉन्सेप्ट में किया है तो मुझे क्या करना है कि आई एम गो हैड एंड आई एम गो प्लेस इट ऑन माई कबर्ड ओवर यर तो मैंने वट एवर यूनिट आई हैव यूर फॉर स्टोरेज आई एम जस्ट गोनो गो हैड एंड प्लेस ऑल ऑफ द स्टिकर्स ओवर यर इज अ मेमोरेंडम I wanted to do it on my bike originally, but उसके लिए अलग से कॉन्सेप्ट बाद में निकलेगा फॉर द नियर फ्यूचर टाटो फेस्टिवल इफ आई विजिट एनी ऑफ दम सो एज यू कैन सी आई पेस्टेड ऑल ऑफ दम ऑन दिस स्टोरेज कवर रिलेटेड में वर्क एज अ वर्क स्टेशन यूनिट इज वेल 